and welcome to yet another bullet journal recap. Today we'll be recapping for the month of July, even though technically speaking I was supposed to post this on August 1st. Things happen so it will be posted during the middle of the of the month, which is okay. Either way I'm here. Um, as you can see we have different jewelry this time around. It is gold instead of silver. Technically speaking, gold is my preferred jewelry. I just was having silver because I only had silver rings at the time. I used to be a silver girl, but now I'm a gold girl. Uh, been a gold girl for a really long time, just it hasn't been recently till I've been able to get gold rings. Um, but moving on, we're going to look at the golds. Gold? Golds. Goals and bucket list. So obviously haven't finished writing the first book. This is more of an end of month goal. Um, a thousand followers on Instagram. Uh, instead I have 72, which is more than last time. Yay. Next is YouTube. And we're no longer at that steady 13 that I've had since the beginning of the year. Now I have 16. Let's go. Anyway, um, not a thousand, but hey, it. I, I'm not complaining. Anyway, um, moving over to TikTok. Still don't have a thousand, but I got forty. So, hey, growth is growth. Anyway, um, moving over to the bucket list. We have make a writer friend. I, I wouldn't say that I have like a writer friend. I have a lot of mutuals, which I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say like, oh, they're not my friends, but like your friend is somebody, they like, yo, I just finished this book. Or like I I just got done. Like you you tell them everything about what you're doing and they tell you everything about what they're doing. A mutual is somebody that like you promote their posts, you occasionally like you interact with their posts. Like you're just like you're a supporter. You're like a profound avid follower supporter and they support you you support them that's a mutual okay that's a mutual they're more like acquaintances a writer friend is like that's bestie you know anyway i ain't got one of those yet have many mutuals which i'm very happy and grateful for um participate in anorimo that's something that happens in november of course, I finished upgrading my work and writing station. That's something that I showed off in a previous um, recap. I forgot which one it was. A part of me wants to say February. I think it was February where I showed it off. Um, but yeah, no, I've upgraded the workstation and finished the website. Dude, I, I'm trying. I'm trying to get this done and finished and out. But every single time that I go in to edit, I get more ideas or I don't have any ideas. <laughs> so it's just like, I'm just staring at it endlessly. But I'll figure out something. I'll figure out something. Um, moving on to what we'll actually be filling in for today. So we're going to be filling in the highlight for July. Um, I still haven't finished this book. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'll finish this book eventually. Now I actually have a reason why I haven't finished the book. The reason is because I'm a beta reader now. I'm a beta reader for a writer that goes by Michaela Jade. I don't know if that's her real name or if that's her pen name. Either way, author is Michaela Jade. Wonderful person. And she has two books already up. I'm beta reading the third one. Actually, there's going to be a video posted soon about my experience being a beta reader for like the first week. So, yeah, this is kind of being put onto the back burner for a little bit. Even though it technically has been on the back burner for a while. Anyway, um, other than that, we're going to fill in the Did You Write? This month, I'm really proud. And you'll see why I'm really proud about the Did You Write? for the month of July. And then we're gonna fill in the whip progress. Um, I made a mistake here, which I'll show you where I made that mistake. This is June. Oh yeah, this is where I'm gonna show you where I made the mistake. I credited the 910 fieldwork and research for June 
when technically I finished it in July. I'm just, there's not really anything I can do about it because the color that I'll be using for July is this. And if I color over it, it's just gonna look black. So I'm just gonna like leave it be. But technically I completed 911, 911, wow, 910 research um, in the month of July. Also, I'm still gonna put air quotes around that. It's a long story that I won't get into in this video, but a different video. Anyway, um, but let's look into what we got done. So ANL editing, that's a box. MPHL Pro Edit or Professional Edit, so an edit that's done by a professional editor, that is done. 910 Research, so that completes the 910 Research, Fieldwork and Research. Um, BB Personal Rework, uh, that's, yeah, that's also a box. CL Final Draft, that's also a box. So everything gets a box. Sadly, except for 910 because I... I messed up. I messed up. Anyway. Let me just do. The cross hatches for everything. Uh, we are still waiting for some progress right here so I can fill in this box. So we're just going to fill in these four with this representative marker for the month of July. I, I almost forgot what month we were doing this for. Okay, so that is done, and now we get to look at the highlights. So I've made a call uh, with school starting, as well as seeing the performance of how my weekly bullet journal like recaps have been doing on TikTok, I've decided to no longer do them. I've decided that it's just better for me to do the recaps fully in this video instead of trying to do like a weekly recap about like, oh, well, this is how my week went because A, no one really watches them. Um, B, I actually kind of had fun editing like a full length video talking about the entire month. B, it I, I said A, B, C, I think I'm on C. I don't remember. I don't know how, how did I forget that so quickly? Anyway, next reason is because with school coming up, I would rather limit how many videos I'm making. Um, and when I say videos, I mean like videos that I'm recording. So I would like to limit how much I'm making throughout the year. And with the low performance, and the fact that I find more joy in editing a full length video, talking about all of the highlights, it just seemed to make more sense to just cut weekly updates out completely. So that's no longer a thing on TikTok. If you enjoyed those videos, I am sorry, but I had to make a call. Um, they will return just when I have more time and when more people are interested. Okay? Okay. Uh, which means we get to go through the entirety of this list. Um, on the first, I officially came back from my big break. Yeah, so all those videos that you see that have been published like from back to back to back to back to back, it was because I took a really long break for both education purposes and because busy purposes and, and all that good stuff. And I officially came back in the month of July. So that was what happened on the first. On the second, this is me figuring stuff out, getting my schedules together, and just testing out the water, seeing what I can do and seeing what I can't do. On the third, I made myself a big 
breakfast and I contemplated about getting a pen pal. Um, no longer contemplating about it anymore because again, time. It was one of those situations of like, oh, this sounds like a really good idea. And then being like, eh, I don't got the time or money for that. So um, just scratch that out completely. On the 4th, the 4th of July, fireworks um, and, and smoke everywhere. On the 5th, I made huge progress on my whip, um, something that I will talk more about in the BV1 update for the month of July. On the 6th, I was sick, but I was still writing. On the 7th, I rested, uh, but I still managed to edit, which was nice. On the 8th, I did more editing and randomly posted on Wattpad. Oh my god, I completely forgot I did that. So I posted a prologue of a fan fiction where Toji from Jujutsu Kaisen steals a biggie bag from you. Yeah, I, I haven't made any progress on it because time and energy. And yeah, it was more like a one-off thing that I may or may not continue whenever I have like more time. But yeah, that, 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 I, I did that. Anyway, on the 6th, wait, no, wait, I just went back, my bad. On the 9th, I went to the dentist, had to reschedule. Reason why I had to reschedule is because they inputted me as a kid when I'm not, I'm 19. And they also, I think they had my address wrong. They had just like, they just had wrong information. So I had to reschedule. On the 10th, had Chinese food. On the 11th, had sushi. Um, on the 12th, made homemade pizza. Oh, by the way, I just now realized people are wondering, I'm like, oh my God, you have sushi so often. It's because there's so many sushi spots. There's so many local spots. It's not like, boom, like just dropping $200 every single, like, no, 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 no. If we, if we want to splurge at most, the bill is like 60, um, but at the least it's like 20. And that's only because like we got two rolls, but, um, yeah, sushi is a very like common thing in Nevada. Like it, it sits there. There's a lot. There's a lot of sushi places here. Um, more specifically in the city that I'm in. I'm not gonna say what city, but I feel like that the excessive amounts of sushi would make what city it is obvious for the people that live in said city. Anyway, um, on the twelfth, made homemade pizza. On the thirteenth, I became a beta reader. Something that that did I talk about that? I did. Yeah, the Michaela Jade. Yeah, da da da. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. <laughs> oh my god I just keep on forgetting stuff um on the 14th I did an escape room with my bestie on the 15th I figured out wallpaper for my personal cell phone um essentially what I wanted was multiple wallpapers to show up whenever I logged into my personal cell phone I'm gonna show all the different pictures up right now and they're all from the anime Yu Yu Hakusho my Baby, oh shit, my, I shook the camera, um, my baby, I, I, I love Yu Yu Hakusho with all of my heart, it's the anime that I grew up with, it's the first anime that I've ever experienced, and even after re-watching it, it's still on the top of my list because of writing. I would like to go into like an in-depth like thing about Yu Yu Hakusho, do I have a little bit of bias? Probably. I want to show you something, actually. I want to show you. Oh, ah, ah, ah. This is Yusuke. Yeah. It's a Funko Pop. Anyway, okay. I'm done geeking out. Probably. Probably. I'll always be a geek and I'll always geek out. That's something that you guys are going to have to get used to. Anywho. Um... Where did I leave off on? Okay, the 16th, I switched around beta readers. Also something that I'm go gonna go into further detail in like the BV1 update. But long story short, current beta reader wasn't, so I switched to, to different, yeah. Anyway, um, on the 17th, auntie visited. On the 18th, auntie from my dad's side, right? Right, 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 anyway. 
<laughs> on the 18th, I was helping my friend with college things. First time going into college. I've been in college for like a year now, going to the same college as me. So I was able to kind of guide them, figure it, figure out like what the situation is. Anyway, um, on the 19th, my aunt came back and brought my baby cousin. That boy has so much energy. It's crazy. At the same time, he's like, what? 12? I know that he's younger than my brother. But he's like running around doing so much stuff. Just exhausting so much energy. And yet he still had more. Anyway, on the 20th, my it was my other auntie's birthday. Uh, yeah, and she came down to visit. To go and celebrate her birthday on the 21st i baked mini cookies and had a movie night with my bestie and another friend on the 22nd i enjoyed an empty house an empty house meaning without my aunt without my other aunt and without my baby cousin because it was just like back to back to back to back people being over at the house during times that we weren't exactly prepared to have people over at the house but it doesn't matter because they're family. I, I mean, it matters, but you know what I mean. Like, it's like, it, yeah. It was just nice to go from, damn, this is a lot of people, to like, okay, like, we're chill. We get to, we're okay now, you know? So, on the 23rd, late night Minecraft gaming session and a huge personal decision. Um, not going to go into too much detail about that because, again, it's a personal decision. Yay. Anyway, 24th. Uh, feeling off and feeling tired. This was when I was, like, getting sick again. And I just didn't know that I was getting sick. So I rested. Um, I, ha I had Philly cheesesteaks. Um, and I made some adjustments that related to the personal decision. Um both in terms of writing as well as with this. Um, on the 28th, I ended the day on a bad note. This was due to me realizing that some of the stuff that I know personally, or that some of the stuff that I know, other people don't know. And so I had to tell these like other people like, hey, this is how things are supposed to be. You're kind of overstepping right now. Essentially like setting a boundary, which isn't which isn't something that I have to do a lot because my friends aren't bad people. <laughs> so it's not like setting boundaries isn't something that happens often. Um, but it was also like the type of boundary where it's like, I wish that you were this type of person that I could do this with, but you're not, therefore you can't do this anymore type boundary. So it was like, I wanted, I wanted it to work out. It didn't work out, boom, boundary set, you know? So that's why I ended on, on a bad note. Uh, on the 29th, uh, sorting out rides because after enjoying an empty house, my mom went on a trip to go and visit my dad and as you guys know I have a learner's permit I can't drive in a car by myself so I needed to figure out how I was going to get from one side of town to the other side of town so I could watch Deadpool and Wolverine with my friends my uncle ended up driving me and I appreciate it I appreciate him for it um sorry I always run out of breath I don't have strong lungs I have asthma so Forgive the breathiness and yeah. Anyway, on the 30th, I watched Deadpool and Wolverine. And on the 31st, after like all the hype settled in, I just got hype again. And I was like, oh my God, I watched Deadpool and Wolverine. So it was great. It was great. Awesome. 10 out of the 10 month. The biggest like highlight of the month is returning back to the internet. Coming back to you guys and making content once again because that's basically what I was like working towards for the entirety of June not entirety but like for like the last bit of June and something that I was working on for 
like everywhere else. Anyway, so um, what I'm gonna put here is, what am I gonna put here? Oh, returning to the internet. So I'm gonna put, I'm back. I'm also gonna put Deadpool and Wolverine. Um, um, put aunts, um, slash just family in general. So, yeah, and then just gonna go ahead and color that in. Okay, for the month of June. And I'm gonna go ahead and return back over here, right? This is the wrong one. Oh, nope, that's August. D ignore that, ignore the fact that August is not even done. <laughs> and we're in the middle of the month. Please ignore that, please, please, please. Anyway, um, but look at this, look at this, look at this. I wrote for every single day of the month, yay. Um. I say that is a very nice and profound accomplishment of mine. Um, really happy for it. Anyway, the whole entirety of the playlist is done. Um, if you want to listen to the playlist, the playlist is always linked in the description, just so you guys know. Anywho, um, we're going to go ahead and fill in the did you write for... Um, this month <sighs> and once I do that's the wrong side of the marker once I do um we'll be we'll be pretty much done um another thing is that I'm glad that I've I've that I have no wait right I have no gray so I don't even need this marker oh my god I'm so happy I'm so happy um anyway <laughs> let's just go ahead and fill this right on in alrighty about you guys but I say that for the month of July that makes up from all of the gray <laughs> from the previous months um so yeah I I'd say that concludes it right fill this in fill that in fill this in um yeah okay so <laughs> with all that being said that concludes this video Thank you for watching all the way through. Of course, it'd be greatly appreciated. Greatly appreciated to subscribe, like, comment, and share. At the same time, I can't force you. All I can do is hope you stick around to see my creations. Have a good rest of your day or night. I'm Honey Lee, and it was a pleasure talking to you all. Bye bye.